Is something wrong? It's just that my friends made me the most beautiful dress, but my stepmother and stepsisters ruined it, and I was so looking forward to the ball. <laughs> Darkness always finds a way into a wounded heart. You have to be strong. Strength of heart will carry you through the hardest of trials. But I... Unversed! Not all you need. Huh? There's nothing left to believe in. Nothing. Nothing, my dear. Oh, now, you don't really mean that. Oh, what I do? It's just no use. Nonsense. If you'd lost all your faith, I couldn't be here. And here I am. Oh, come now. Dry those tears. You can't go to the ball looking like that. The ball? Oh, but I'm not. Of course you are. But we'll have to hurry. Now, what were those magic words? Oh, yes! Bibbidi bobbidi boo! Beautiful dress. Huh? Why, it's a dream come true. Yes, but like all dreams, I'm afraid this can't last forever. You'll have only till midnight, and then on the stroke of twelve, the spell will be broken, and everything will be as it was before. Yes, I understand.
Her heart was full of light. Why didn't I see it? What did you do? I can hardly tell she's the same person. Who are you? Tara. Tara, in your heart, do you believe that dreams can come true? I do. But I also believe you have to make an effort to make them come true. Yes, of course. But sometimes just believing in dreams is easier said than done. Cinderella believes her dreams can come true. I wanted her to see that she is right. So that's what made her shine. Faith in her heart that anything is possible. Where did she go? To the royal ball at the palace. Go, and when you see her dancing, you'll know that she believes, and that will help you to believe too. Here too. <gasps> I've met you before. I'll take care of them. You wait right here. Please, may I go with you? I so want to get to the ball. Um. All right. But stay behind me, or you'll get hurt. <laughs> You're not worried? Didn't you tell me it was important to stay strong? Oh. Um, I, I guess I did. <laughs> <laughs> so, you ready? Yes. <laughs> Help. Yeah. 
please help! Take that! Thank you, um... Terra. Thank you, Terra. Maybe just believing is enough. But who is she, Mother? Do we know her? Well, the Prince certainly seems to. I've never seen her before. Nor I. But she certainly is. Wait. There is something familiar about her. Unversed. <laughs> Tell me, how do I get up there? Um, well, uh, there is a passage beneath the foyer staircase. Thanks.
Saved us all. <sighs> the guests were just starting to enjoy themselves. Well, don't give up just yet. Oh! Tell me something. Have you always had a problem around here with those monsters? No. I believe uh, they began to appear. Shortly after a boy in a mask arrived in our kingdom, those that saw him said the monsters obeyed his every command. A boy in a mask? Do you know where he is now? Well, um, no. I don't believe anyone has seen him since then. I see. Oh, my goodness. It's midnight. Yes. So it is. But why? Goodbye. Wait. Come back. 
Please come back. I'm sorry. Mademoiselle! Senorita! Wait! Aqua! Tara! Tara, Ven ran away from home. What? I think he left to go find you. Do you have any idea why? No. Actually, just before I left, he tried to tell me something. I should have listened to what he had to say. Oh. So, did you manage to locate Master Zaynort? No, but it seems he's looking for pure hearts filled with light. Pure hearts filled with light? All I can tell you is that his search hasn't taken him here. All right. I'll stay and see if I can find more clues. Okay. The prince is in the ballroom ahead. He might have some answers. Thanks. <laughs> Aqua! You still have the same dream? Well, yes. There's this girl here. Her name is Cinderella. She made me realize how powerful it is just to believe. No matter how impossible things seem, a powerful enough dream will always be enough to light the darkness. Mm. If you see her, give her my thanks. Will do. The boy in the mask who is leading the unversed. Who is he? Does he have anything to do with Master Xehanort's disappearance? 